It's hard to believe, but situations like this don't seem to phase me anymore. And here I thought I was going to be able to kick back and enjoy the northern lights every night. The IV, BGA, and CT are all ready to go. So is the blood count and cross-matching test. <laughs> Just let me know if you think you're recovering too quickly. I can change some of these numbers and extend your vacation. We don't have time to wait. We have to begin the procedure immediately. My name is Valerie Blaylock. I'll be treating you. Don't worry. You've been badly injured, but it's not hopeless. In fact, you're quite lucky that there are two skilled doctors in a remote place like this. I need to hurry up and get back into the swing of things here. I've stabilized him with an IV and a blood transfusion, but he needs to be operated on right away. Don't worry, you can count on us. I'm Elena Salazar from the Concordia Medical Institute in Los Angeles. I know this is an emergency, but please allow me to advise you on the situation. The patient is a Caucasian male in his 50s. He's suffering from a gunshot wound from a rifle. The bullet didn't exit his body. It's still inside him. Due to the excessive amount of bleeding, there's a possibility the bullet nicked his heart. The patient has suffered a large laceration extending from his right shoulder to his chest. He also has a compound fracture in his right arm. You're the only ones who can help him. This disease can be debilitating, but the symptoms haven't progressed that far just yet. I'm in better spirits than I look. In fact, I even make the rounds occasionally. Of course, that's only for the time being. This hospital and I have grown old together. I believe it's time for both of us to retire. Dr. Vaughn, Dr. Blaylock, you two should return to Concordia. 